How's it going, everybody? It is April 7th. This will be merged by Amazon Sales Update, and I'll talk about the first six days. It's it's fairly early in the morning, and today's actually going really well. I, I have six sales already, but I don't know how the day will end, and uh, and hopefully it will be actually a really good day. So I'll start with, uh, with uh, that theme and talk about a good day, and that would be yesterday. So yesterday, I had 10 sales in the US, and overall, I had 12 sales, which to me is, uh, is actually not so bad. My, my US sales um, have been pretty disappointing for the last uh, little while. Uh, the, the total sales always make me happy because of the royalties that I make at the end of the month. But if I'm looking at the sales uh, and US sales specifically, I mean, the, the fact that the sevens and a 10 it looks like a spike to me is is actually very disappointing but that's okay because like i said i'm looking at the bigger picture i'm looking at my sales overall and kind of where i'm headed which direction so even though for example for this month i have 37 sales in the us which is about six uh, sales a day on average uh, i'm looking at 64 total sales which is you know now we're talking closer to to 10 sales a day uh, on average and consistently so that's okay. I'm, I'm, I'm okay with those kinds of numbers because I know that if I get 300 sales a month, that equals to about about $1,000 in royalties and, and that's fine. But I, of course, you know, the point here is to, to have growth and uh, to, to actually get better. Now, the, the thing that actually kind of motivates me and f makes me feel better is the direction that I'm going in with my new designs, right? And I've talked about this before. I'm not so much concentrating anymore on hitting my max uploads for the day. I'm, I'm concentrating on quality of my designs and, and kind of being a, a little strategic about it. I'm still a little disappointed in this number. I, I want to increase this faster, much, much faster than I already have been. Uh, but that's, I can leave that for another video. And, um, and, and just to say that the new designs and, and why I do feel optimistic is because they're selling across all the different marketplaces. And this is actually the first time that I'm strategically listing uh, products where I can see them selling, for example, uh, in Germany or France or Italy more than they would in the US. And, uh, and that's just simply because of the opportunity that, that's there. And, and I only realized that after I had a few really good months, for example, in Germany and Japan and, and Italy, and, and I realized that, you know what, there are certain products that can take off in those marketplaces as well. They could also be English-based designs if you're talking about text-based designs. And, uh, and then you can also tweak certain graphic designs to, to make it a little more uh, specific to those marketplaces. So, so that's why I, I, ca I feel good overall. Uh, but again, I, I really have to go back and talk about the, the really disappointing uh, U.S. sales. I, I really hope... Uh, you know that I, I don't know what's going to change because I won't be I'm not planning to run any ads anytime soon so I'm hoping that my new uh, designs will and this is not loading for some reason uh, designs will actually uh, work in the US marketplace as well uh, but but we'll see uh, this is not what I actually wanted to put up so let's see this is the chart and I'll let it load for a second but it's the monthly performance and I wanted to basically say uh, how I am not happy about it. And then there's a significant drop here, right? And never improved, even though I am consistently uh, listing products. But that's okay, like I said, if I'm consistently getting a um, thousand bucks a month in royalties on my worst months, I'm, I'm okay with that for now. But again, of course, the goal is always to improve, to make more sales, to have more you know, listings that get flagged by Amazon as, as Amazon's choice or get a bunch of feedback and continue those sales. This is actually funny to see all threes. Uh, but uh, but anyways, that's that's where I am right now. Let me know how you guys are doing in the comments, right? Because not just for me, I'm always curious. Uh, but if you're somebody in tier 500 making, you know, 100 sales a day, uh, I'm sure other people would want to know how and why and, and the fact that you just are. So let us know what tier you're in, how your sales are going, and, and we'll go from there. As always, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you soon.